Rydell! I pulled an all-nighter on those client cars. Looking good, right? Not bad at all. But you need to remove the filter to make sure you fit the plug back properly. Come on now. No, I don't. You know I'd be happier if you did it by the book. I had like three cars to do. This way was faster. Okay, well, let's see what the client says. They're expecting it back today. Now, hey, why don't you grab some coffee? You look tired. That's all you can say to me after I worked all night? Yeah, whatever. I'm gonna take a walk and clear my head. Hey, Yes. We good? Yeah, we're good. Great. So, uh, what's up? Can you pick up a buddy of mine? He's got some heat on him, needs some fast wheels. You got it. Heading there now. Yo, what's with your boy Rydell? My boy? Take the filter out? I busted my ass all night while he was watching the spins lose another game. Didn't you volunteer? Whatever. Don't take it personal. He appreciates you. You know he does. So you on his side now? Yeah, it's, it's not about sides, right? Del just likes things done his way. Yes? Yes? Damn. Rudiger. I need to get to my safe house. Now. Wow, Rudiger, no foreplay, huh? What is this, a date? I need a ride, or are we going to have a problem? We cool, buddy. I got you. Huh, guess you're not so big on small talk, are you? I'd rather you talk less and drive more. No problem at all, Rudiger. I don't need to fill the void with talk, chit-chat, back and forth. Nope, not me. I'm totally cool. Just sitting in silence, alone with my thoughts. I can still hear you. Okay, I guess you didn't fully suck. Wow, glowing endorsement. Hey, before you go, can I get a review from you? Because I think it would really, really help me out. Are you always this needy? Damn, Rudiger, I... I really thought we had something going here. Just get me to where I need to be. Cops seem like they really want to talk. It's the same everywhere. They've made their mind up about you and want to take you down. Ah, I got it. You're innocent. Depends on your definition of innocent. Uh, not guilty? Then no. I'm not, as you say, innocent. Okay, then. wasn't bad. You've made a friend today, friend. And my friend... Hey, Rydell. Yo, kid, you a yes? No, out of my own. What's up? Just called to say the client was really happy with their car. Nice work, team. Happy. We do. Check out our deal on Prime Ribeye, aisle 19. Where are you? The supermarket. I'm thinking about, uh, buying up the old drum out back. Get one of my briskets going. I'll do my dad's secret marinade you like so much. You know, to celebrate. Ooh, I am in. All right. Tell your ass when you speak to her, okay? Sure thing. Yo, what's up? Reddell called. He's firing up his oil drum and making his brisket with his dad's secret marinade. You in? I'm busy. Come on, yes. He said the clients liked their cars. So? So he's happy. He wants to celebrate together. Then why didn't he call me? I put in the work. Now dude thinks he can win me over with brisket? Nah, bruh. Just talk it out. We'll see that he means I got a call coming through. Later.
one after this perp, too. The competition just got interesting. <laughs> I'm gonna bathe the champagne tonight! Macho order is restored. This bench oh, appears to be uh, flying. You think you're pretty good, huh? So long, loser. Control here to take the boat down, dispatch. <laughs> These races don't give a damn about people out here, dispatch. Stevenson, you've been in office for a while now. What are your plans for Lakeshore? You know, now more than ever, we need to back the boys in blue as they protect us from those who treat Lakeshore like their own personal playground. From graffiti to street racing, these illicit activities are tearing our once great city apart like wet tissue paper. If you want a cleaner, safer Lakeshore, support my plans. Exactly what we need. More cops who hate racers on the streets. Yo, check out that tuning kit. That's the look I'd be going for, no doubt. Rydell, where'd that come from? The tuning kit? I ordered it for a customer, but they never picked it up, so it's just gathering dust. It's up for grabs? Yeah, it cost. Thanks, boss. This will make the car look dope for the race on Saturday. Hey, you know we got that big money race coming up? We better make sure our ride is looking the part. Yo, tell me when you ready to head out. I'm not spending all night here again. Yo, you both on hand here tonight? Uh, no, nah, I was just saying we going out. Oh, okay. Oh, you just be careful out there, all right? You got more cars coming in early, too. Will do, boss. Damn, dude only cares about his business. I hear there's some sick race routes planned tonight. Let's tear the lake up. Out. Some chick is live streaming about the mayor. Alec just shot me a link. Alec? Yeah, you know, the guy from that thing. Shh, she's on. What's up, Lakeshore? Okay, so tonight's live stream will expose the corruption behind the no nonsense for nonsense policy. <sighs> cute name, right? But there's nothing cute about what's happening to the people of this city. Look, we have inside information that will finally expose this administration and how they are the real criminals of Lakeshore. But first, do you like your mattress? Oh, shit. I think I hate my mattress. Yo, what would you say if I told you there was a way to make some cash besides racing? I'd say I like both my kidneys. Nothing serious yet, but my boy Alec could be looking for a driver. Hold on, remind me. Alec is... Friend I rolled with from before. We were in the same foster home.
damn, you see the buy-ins on some of these races? We can't get that kind of cash playing it safe. There's got to be another way. You're just giving your money away. chase right here, right now. Yo, I heard from Alec. He's legit impressive. Got a major hustle. Hustle? Gonna hit him up and see if he's got something for us. How come I've never met him before? You've never met my Uncle Choppy either. I got people you don't know, all right? All right. As I said, we came up in the system together. We looked out for you. Yeah, I know. I came through that system too, remember? You got lucky. I bounced around so much. Alec was there for me when no one else was. When I came to Rydell's, we drifted apart. But he called me a couple of days ago out of the blue. Out of the blue, huh? No, it's not like that. He saw us race and reached out. Look, he's good people. He can help us out with getting some more money. All right, all right, fine. I trust you. I know that. We're going to kill it. Ooh, a 
a new Lake Lab episode just dropped. And that is why you should never feed a possum ice cream. Somebody's gonna have to clean that up. <laughs> but anyway, for those of you who are just joining us, we're focusing on the recent revelations that Mayor Stevenson's sister holds a prominent role on the board of Waterside Construction. Yeah, the company that has been awarded the largest renovation contract in Lakeshore history. You know, I think it's safe to say we can file that under conflict of interest, right guys? On today's episode, I'll be looking at how this was allowed to go through without facing the public. Yeah, wait, why shouldn't you feed a possum ice cream? Looks like Alec might be at the meetup. Let's make sure we impress out there. All right. Just locked in some more clients. Words getting out about this garage. Great. I'm happy for you. Happy for us? I wouldn't be here without you two. This garage isn't just a business. It's a family. That must be why we get minimum wage. There's a bunch of cars needing a tune-up. You game? Yeah, sure thing. back at the garage? I, I wasn't really paying attention. What do you say? Do you know how many times I've heard the we're a family speech? Trust me, the only person you should be loyal to is yourself. Yes, why? Hey, Rydell. Hey, just wanted to wish you both luck for the big race. You got this. Thanks, Pops. Just remember, don't just say shit. Win shit. Win shit. That's right. Well, break it. Oh, I'm going with this. See you back at the garage. What was that about? Maybe he's just trying to apologize. It usually starts with sorry. Well, that's just Rydell. He's old school. Yeah, old something. <laughs> All right. Yo, looks like Alex here. Do your thing. I told him to look out for us. He was very interested in our car. So, let's not disappoint. Some competition. 
missing. Damn good. A few more tweaks and we'll be first next time, no doubt. That was such a buzz. Doing our thing. We belong out there. Born to race. We showed them we got the skills to compete. We gotta let Rydell know how we did. I can imagine his goofy face. Sam? Yeah, impressive, huh? Little garage run by. I told you, bro. I don't know, like a what? A bunch of what? What, tonight? Yeah, you know it. Thanks. Peace. All right. What was that about? Alex gig. Wait, now? I, I thought we were going back to the garage. Transport job. Simple pick up and drop off. He's sending over the info now. We're not passing this up. It's our time, yo. All right, fine. Let's do this. I don't know, yeah. This seems sketchy. What did I say about taking risks? If we impress this guy, we'll reap the benefits. But there's no second chances. Do you have any idea what ride we're picking up? No, and my boy, something legit. Damn, yes. Nice. You take it. I'll drive out to the drop-off behind you. On it. We're keeping this little job between us, right? Ooh, don't mind if I do. For sure. I can't wait to see what this thing can do. Shit! Damn it! Jasmine, is this car hot? Uh, maybe. Let's split up. I'll meet you at the drop-off. Got it. Stay safe. Twenty-four forty got away from me. Dispatch. Suspect pulled the disappearing act at University Central. 
gonna have to terminate this pursuit, dispatch. Suspect got away. Come on, Yaz. Pick up. Pick up. Yo, it's Yaz. Leave a message and I might get back to you. Probably won't, but I might. Yo, Yaz, where are you? I'm at the drop-off and there's nothing here. Are you sure this Alec guy gave you the right address? Shit! Yes, the garage alarm just went off. Are you satisfied with this message? Screw it. Gotta get back to the garage. Thanks for calling Rydell's Rides. Call back during normal business hours. Shit. Yo, it's Yaz. Leave a message and I might get back to you. Probably won't, but I might. Shit! Where is everybody? No, no, no. <sighs> Shit, Rydell, you okay? They emptied a lot. Wait here. Shit! I knew it. I told y'all. Jasmine, who is that? I don't know that dude. Yes, yeah, let's go. They just said your name. Right, Del, she was with me all night. Who did you tell about this place? I didn't. You didn't what? You didn't go to the Heights? Laugh about how trusting the old man is? Well, who's gonna trust me now? Hold up! Took your ass in when no one else wanted you. Whoa, Rydell, you gotta chill. Yes, wait! What the hell? Did she just take the car? Kia, she took everything. Lakeshore. She grabbed the mob. Re-elect Mayor Morgan Stevenson, the leader Lakeshore deserves. Hey, Rydell. Kind of dead again today. Oh, some little lady came in for an oil change. She didn't have any money, though. Just samosas. Yours is in the fridge. Well, I'm gonna lock up for now. See if I can make a few extra bucks on the side. Oh, I cleaned out the storeroom. And dude, you were right. It's a possum, not a rat. So, yeah.
He's still in there. Oh, hey, the book you ordered came in. Bro, if you ever need to talk, I'm here. I'll be in early tomorrow to open up, okay? Peace. All right. Who needs a ride? Rydell's right. Need a lift? Hey, name's Tess. Heard you might be a good person to call for a cheap ride. I'll hit you with the address on where I'm heading. No sweat. Be there soon.